What's going on, everybody? It's the Live Fishing Ninja. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Live and Live Fishermen. I've been out here at Fall River for a while and haven't hooked into anything, but I got one. We got a fish, got a fish. <clears throat> we got one. As long as we can get him out of this current, we'll be all right. We will be all right. <clears throat> Get my net ready to go. There we go. Getting a good spot here. Oh, beautiful fish. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Got him. We got him. We got him. All right. All right. So this is a God, this is a beautiful fish. Hell of a way to start the day. Hell of a way to start the day. All right. A couple quick things I want to talk about is holding a fish properly. Been reading some articles and. Uh, I might have been doing it wrong quite a bit of the time. So the first thing you want to do is you want to wet your hands. And when you hold the fish to get a picture or whatever, um, you want to make sure you grab them behind their fins right here because their heart, gills, and everything are actually underneath this area. So you don't want to be squeezing their heart. So you want tail, and behind the fins, you don't, and you want to kind of cradle the fish. There we go. That's how you properly hold the trout, so you're not smashing their heart or their behind these pectoral fins. Check that out. 